The Columbus SCOTUS football program has added another state title to its name. The Shamrocks clashed with undefeated Norfolk Catholic at Memorial Stadium, defeating the Knights 32-7 to claim SCOTUS's third state championship in school history. The thing that made the biggest difference was special teams, you know, you know, flipping the field, getting the getting the ball with a short field. So, you know, very, very excited about how our kids played, you know, three phases of football, not just two tonight. Rushing for 306 yards on the day, the Shamrocks did what they do best. Bailey Pelster got SCOTUS on the board with his team's opening possession before being knocked out of the contest with an ankle injury. Head coach Tyler Linder said his heart broke for the senior wingback, but that his team did a great job rallying. Brady Prismas and Cole Harrington found the end zone in the first half for SCOTUS, while Matt Miller hit Miles Verbka from 17 yards out, and David Engelhop punched it in for the Knights before the break. The Shamrocks took a 19-14 lead into halftime and shut the Knights out in the third quarter, while Jake Boss rose to the occasion by kicking two field goals from 42 and 53 yards out to give SCOTUS a 25-14 lead, heading into the fourth. In pregame, I didn't miss one, so I just felt pretty, pretty happy about that. The contest came down to the final drive as Norfolk Catholic cut the lead to five points and got the ball back with just over a minute to play. But the Shamrocks defense forced a fumble to seal the game. We just did what we usually do. We just pounded it down them, uh, stuck with the game plan, uh, played great defense, and you know we played great competition all season. And man. Our players, when we get on a big show, we really step up. Oh, it's been 22 years since we since we won a state title, and and it, it means a lot to our fans and to our and to our SCOTUS as a whole. Uh, it's it's just a feeling that you can't describe. It hasn't hasn't really hit yet that we won it, but it will sometime. Norfolk Catholic head coach Jeff Beller tipped his hat to the Shamrocks, but felt his team didn't play to their full potential. We played a good football team, and I think. I think give them credit and things of things they've done, but we had more mistakes than we typically make as a team. Hard to win a state championship when you make a lot of mistakes. The win gives SCOTUS its first state title since 1993 and the first under head coach Tyler Linder in his second year at the helm. You know, I'm going to really enjoy this one, you know, and I hope uh, I hope SCOTUS can, uh, and we can keep bringing teams back. I'm Brandon Axbit in Lincoln reporting, News Channel, Nebraska.